Hello and welcome and today we are at Bedolf Grange Gardens beautiful little walk ahead we've just got here it's just after 12 o'clock and uh, as you saw at the intro of the video we have a map uh, it's quite a long walk but I'm looking forward to it so I hope you all enjoy the video we've just come off the path just up there and walked down and we just got to this lovely little bit of a garden area just here and there is a I think them damsons growing on this tree just here it's a little uh, shopping cart here All plants produce one pound fifty per tray, pot or bunch. That's quite snazzy. I don't know what. Uh, looks like there's a few chop logs and stuff just here. That tree looks pretty old. Not hundred percent sure on which way to go. There's a quite a few different routes. And some beautiful flowers. Just here though this is uh, just one little small section and uh, we'll carry on the walk just back up this way There's a little garden here, it's like a little orchard. Quite nice. Just continuing with the walk. There is the place we've just been is known as the orchard plot. That's where we started off, and just here says no entry. So entry is just down there, it's £12 per person, and not a bad price to be fair, just up these steps. It'll sit down in uh, area here. And the tea rooms just there, and also a restroom as well. Unfortunately, we have had quite a lot of rain, so not many people will will be sat outside. this 
big stone seat. And just over there is a beautiful house and the gardens. So this is Camellia House and just look how beautiful, absolutely stunning. It's wonderful. I will be going down the steps and uh, exploring the gardens and the surrounding areas in more detail. But I thought I'd just come here and give you uh, a bird's eye view of the uh, the area first. Just head down the the staircase to the gardens. I was just up that way, just up there. This truly is beautiful, nice relaxing walk. There's a little uh, sign just here. Please keep to the paths. Of course, uh, it's only right that we, uh, we follow the rules on such a nice uh, garden walk. So this is closed for essential maintenance. Just here. I don't know if this is a little lake or a pond. That's beautiful. Just relaxing. There's actually little steps down into the water as well. So if the ducks want to come up onto the land, they've got a little stairway. There's a little bench just here as well, so you can sit down when obviously when it's a bit dry. Just listen to the ducks quack and just enjoy this peace and tranquility. Just walked up from down by the uh, the pond. And just head in this way. I have just noticed though, it's a beautiful little passageway with some extraordinary beautiful flowers. Unfortunately, there is quite a few puddles. But just look at how beautiful and colourful all these flowers are. 
And there's a lot of bees about as well, which is always a good sign. It's one of those moments I find when filming. You find something really beautiful to film and you try and get as much of it as possible on the camera and uh, you always find that you can't get as much as you want on the camera so I will try my best This bit seems to have been uh, dug over. I wonder what they're going to be planting just here. There's some there. No good with uh, flowers. I haven't got a clue what them, what their names are. There's another little passage right there. So many little twists and turns. Really, really, really nice, colourful flowers. That is the passageway we've just walked, and just up here. I think you can walk up the steps to the top level. Let's have a, let's have a look. It's awfully dark. Just follow the passageway all the way round. Oh wow, it's brought us round to this little seating area. Look at the view, that is extraordinary, just beautiful. And turn back round. I always find it amazing you come to these nice places like this and everything is just so perfectly presented. Everything's cut to perfection.